Hey, down here. Okay, so I tried out an app. Um, oh, and I've got off the page and I didn't re realize it. There it is. Super voice recorder on my Alcatel A45L phone. And uh, it worked fine uh, until I went to record a video and it had broken my recording uh, record ability. My, my video app wouldn't work anymore. I opened uh, See where's my apps? Open camera is the one that, that I use and I really like. It has a lot of settings. Um, open camera wouldn't work, and so uh, since that's the last thing I did, you know, I just went ahead and uninstalled the Super Voice Recorder, and sure enough, as soon as I installed it, it worked again. So I guess it fights with the audio inputs. I imagine I put it on there because I was hoping it would. Uh, <coughs> allow me to make my uh i'm trying to use my sure sm58 mic a, a, a real you know a real microphone a professional microphone uh on my phone here with a usb adapter where is that tape? oh here it is what i was doing here is um i'll just leave it where it's sitting okay so this is just a regular usb uh, audio adapter it's an in and out and i bought a uh they, they typically well, fell, so let's get it over here where it can reach you better. Okay, uh, it's all plugged into all my cables. So I have an adapter cable on it. What's the best way to get it? You can see it. Not like that. Okay, like that's better, I guess. This is uh, my cable going into my, uh, or actually, this is the cable, yeah, um, going into my. I get mixed up sometimes. It's been a long time since I even re hooked it up. I just plug it in. Yeah, okay. Um, this is coming from my mic. I guess I've been jacking with this too long. I'm tired. Um, this is my adapter. Okay, this would be... I plug this into my computer normally. So that's coming from... This is coming from my mic. It goes through my cassette deck. That's how I, what I use for a preamp since I don't have a real preamp and um, works fine you know I've been using it for years that way that's a uh, actually I'm going to unplug it it's just a 3.5 millimeter adapter or eighth inch but it, it, it's really a 3.5 millimeter there's just slight difference in eighth inch and 3.5 millimeter and what the cable is is a TRS connector tip ring sleeve um, on this end and on the other end it is two RCA's uh, Similar to an insert cable, if you are familiar with familiar with pro audio equipment and stuff. Uh, this is, like I said, this is, and I know it works. I've used it quite a few times on computers. Just a standard USB connection on this little audio uh, adapter, and it works in in and out. It has an input for a mic or an output for headphones or a line out or whatever this is what I just bought and tried to add to it and use it on my phone I've never used it on a phone before um, it's got a regular size USB here and then it has a micro uh, USB uh, female connector and that's where I plug that's where I have my power adapter my charger cable plugged in that's the supply power it, It'll charge the phone is all it will do so far, but it's supposed to supply power to your device and perhaps charge your phone uh, at the same time. It depends on your phone and your operating system, evidently. Uh, and that may be my whole problem here. Mine is Android 4.3, and that's uh, would and that's as new as I can get. This is a, a phone I got for you know 15 bucks from Walmart, uh, brand new, but. Uh, you know a couple of year last year's model year before whatever uh anyway this is a micro usb and and the the manufacturer the alcatel they haven't sent any more updates i don't think they're going to uh, i might root it and you know update it but i don't know if i'd even want to uh, work they work great the way they are or sometimes i run into things i can't do or whatever but uh, anyway this plugs into the phone perfectly and uh, I've been reading about it, trying to see if there was maybe something I was missing on how to make it work. But uh, um, and before I bought it, I made sure you know there's this whole thing about OTG over OTG cables. 
and uh, there's different pins for different types of phones, different amount of pins and functionality. These are five pins, if I remember right, uh, which is basically the same amount of pins as standard USB. So they don't do, supposedly they don't do in and out at the same time anyway, but it will charge. I know that much. I don't think I can. Let me see. And now everything's falling. <clears throat> okay, let me get this over here. Put my deal here. I think maybe I can use a magnifying glass to show it. Maybe. If I can get to where I can kind of see it on the phone screen, then maybe. Oh, I think that does let you see the outside. But I have looked at them with the magnifying glass. And I have another glass here that's bigger. I mean, it's smaller. It's closer. It makes things look bigger. These are nice glasses. They have lights and on them and stuff. So they're pretty cool. If you get everything just right, you can actually... Of course, I, I can't... Uh, Looking on the phone screen, it's not so... Whoa, that almost did it, didn't it? The thing is, is I, I can see the shape, but I can't see the... Okay, let's see. Get to where I can see it. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five pins. Okay, it's a five pin cable. Uh, my, I have to triple check my memory because it's never, it's not, not as good as I'd like it, like it to be. Okay, so, um, and let's see. I don't imagine I can see that. <laughs> Put it all up. But here's the other thing I would want to know is, is this five pins? And I believe it is, but let's look. Okay, now let me peek around there. One, two, three, four. What? One, two. Uh oh, I think that's four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yep. Okay, so yeah, the standard USB 2.0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Yep, four pins. So this, let's make sure I didn't see that wrong. Spin it the other way and see if I can see it. One, two, three, four. I'm pretty sure I see five in there. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so yeah, it's five, but in here, one, two, three, four. So in here, it's four. Okay, so yeah, well, it had to, to be made right. It would have to be compatible with standard USB, or it would be. I would have probably had something shorter than one, two, three, four. You could probably even see that it looks like it. Okay, so that's right, but what it does then. I mean, I already know it does this, but now it makes more sense to me. Uh, it's split off. The extra pin allows it to be split off here, and one side charges, and the other side just transfers data. But my problem is, 
and supposedly they can send data to your device I mean power to your device at the same time which I with well, four port four pins it should be able to so um, it does charge the phone every time I plug it in the phone starts charging but what it doesn't do is my, my phone doesn't do is doesn't recognize Alcatel a 45 else what I've got uh, with Android 4.3 and like I said I can't upgrade it so and I read earlier that if you have Android 5.0 5.5 and up then uh, it should automatically recognize these audio devices and stuff like that but I thought it would at least recognize my little US I have an SD card that's that works perfectly in my USB adapter I've had it in a one of these phones and it works in the phone it's in the USB adapter right now, but it's a little micro SD card that would fit in your phone. It doesn't recognize that. It doesn't recognize a wireless keyboard uh, either. So uh, I tried. I have two. I have a little one and a big one. Where's the little one? I just had it. I must have put it up or something. Anyway, uh, I didn't think about trying the big keyboard. I might do that before I completely give up. But I don't think. It, I think maybe it's because of my Android uh, OS is too old. But I did notice one thing. Uh, the the article that I read it was one on Hackaday.com. If you've ever paid, uh, read anything on there, I like I read them all the time. But uh, there's where I got the well. I had the idea, but I got I found out that it can work using one of these adapters. And see, I can just plug my microphone into it. This is well. I usually plug my microphone straight into my computer mic input. But I have used this. I bought this for a laptop that I blew out the audio input audio chip actually I did it with the I blew out the output is what I did so I think the input still works uh, plugging speakers into the uh, well I had them plugged in but I, this sound was acting up or went away or something and I, I'm, what I did what I've always done with analog audio unplugged it to plug it back in and it caused a short uh, it's, it's, it's it's something that would never hurt any older audio equipment but it hurt that computer it's a Dell 6000 computer, and I imagine a lot of the new, that, that agent on up is probably going to give you that kind of trouble. So anyway, this works in that computer with Linux and Windows, <coughs> and any other computer I've put it in. Of course not, I don't know about Macs, I don't have Macs. But anyway, um, yeah, I, I, I'm getting to think, I've been reading for two or three hours now <laughs> on uh, different, you know, different ways to get uh, a pro audio mic to hook up to a phone because this in, in built-in mics they only work about I'm like eight inch six inches eight inches from the phone and it works great but if you move the phone around then it starts get the volume it doesn't uh, have any auto adjustment or anything it just you just start losing the volume well maybe it has some auto adjustment auto adjustment I think it does actually but if you move two feet away then you know you can just barely hear you have to turn your most of my videos on this phone you have to turn if I'm not right here in front of it then you have to turn the audio up all the way to hear what I'm saying I'm trying to remedy that problem I thought well you know if I had the phone like here's another one of these I have three of them there's one of them now I'm moving the phone closer to it and I'm getting quieter um, so anyway if I put it on a tripod like that and then ran my cables up to it I could talk on my mic and if I wanted to have myself in the shot that'd be a good way to do that uh, of course, normally if I'm doing uh, the, f the computer m went to sleep, but uh, if I was doing a screen video, then it better better to do a screen a desktop video anyway. But sometimes I do them right quick, you know, when I just want to show something. So, um, yeah, I don't know. Let's see. I don't think I'm going to get to work on these phones doesn't look like it I thought uh, I, be, I, th I thought maybe if I got an app that had that capability it might work I thought maybe but see my uh, open open camera is supposed you know it has a setting in there to use an external mic uh, but it didn't it just you, it didn't make any difference but it says use external mic if available so but the phone's not seeing it so it doesn't matter but this super voice recorder is supposed to sounds good you know and this has good ratings it's supposed to I was showing the thing instead it's supposed to um, work in the way I want it to 
I, uh, of course, it's only I, it, if I, it, but I can't use it for vi video, so I just uninstalled it because I don't really need it, and it doesn't work with my. It didn't help me out. I, I, it was pretty cool. I mean, it starts just recording on it with my. Gives you an a, a audio gain. You can or you can raise and lower the gain on your audio. So it was pretty cool just to record audio with a built-in mic. But uh, I thought it said something about using a USB. Yeah. Oh no, that's USB connection. Maybe it didn't actually say that it would use external mics. I think I've made myself tired. I, I, I just kind of hurried up and picked the, you know, read through the first ones in my search results there. And, oh yeah, that's my open camera. Yeah, I don't. Right now, I'm not seeing anything. But anyway, I'm not going to use that one for sure. I think maybe my. I don't know why my login it keeps wanting me to log in again. Normally I stay logged in all the time. That's still it. I guess I closed the window with my search results. Yeah, I guess I did. So anyway, I'm not going to do that anymore because I, I really think the... Uh, I'm not going to keep trying new apps because I don't think it's an application problem. I think, it, I think it's... Uh, I think it is that the, my phone, since my phone doesn't um, seem to recognize it at all, and I know that this uh, this audio adapter when it's you know plugged into a computer, then it uh, the light comes on. What computer? Let's see. So um, I was going to plug it in, but trust me, I'm not lying. It does. The light comes on. So uh, and I I think when you have a mic either plugged into it, I think the red light. There's a green and a red light on there. I think whenever you have it, uh, a mic plugged in, the red light comes on. I don't remember. I don't. Well, I haven't even used it in a long time. If I plug it into my computer down there, you wouldn't be able to see it. Everything's uh, in the way. You, I couldn't get the phone up there where I could show it. So, um, <coughs> okay. Well, I could try that other keyboard just to make sure, but I don't think it's going to recognize anything. All right, this is going by.